why. On Earth, water exists in the three states, that is to say the solid state, the liquid state and the gas state. In a liquid state, it is the sea, the oceans, and the clouds. In the solid state, we see it, it is snow and ice. And in the gaseous state, we do not see it. In nature, water changes state constantly. For example, the water above the oceans evaporates. We call it evaporation. Allow me a parenthesis here. The word vaporization will be used when studying the boiling of water. Here, the water does not boil. Here is a change of state, and it condenses into a cloud. This cloud that is there, above, carries the water that had evaporated before. The change of state here, when the water vapor becomes liquid, in the clouds and turns into fine droplets of water in suspension, this is condensation. Here, when it's cold, it's solidification. And finally, when the snow melts, we call it melting. This is the easiest. And that's how water comes back after it has melted. After the ice has melted, the water flows and returns to its starting point, i.e. to the sea or the ocean. It is the water cycle. That's it for this video. Thank you.